war. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. We really need to get those vacation photos developed. Hun. Well, look at you. How'd a girl like me ever get so lucky, huh? Thanks, Cosworth. Of course, sir. New Coca Cola, ice cold. Saddle up Salisbury steak, graded A plus. Hmm. 
You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. Hey, hon. Can't believe it's almost Halloween. Oh, need to finish making Sean's costume. Nervous? Don't be. Everyone's gonna love the speech. Can you get the door? Whenever I answer, he just asks for you over and over. Good morning! vault -Tec calling. vault -Tec? Remind me again? Why, we're about you, sir. And helping secure your future. You see, Voltec is the foremost builder of state of the art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. I'm here now. So you are. So you are. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, um, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention a better... Sure, let's do it. Splendid! Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Sir, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think... Hey, Codsworth. Sir, you heard Codsworth. if I may, Sean requires your personal attention. A boy needs his father after. How are the two most important men in my life doing? It's been a little bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth, what's wrong? Followed by, yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with saying? our affiliate stations. We do have, we do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We, we need to get to the vault. Now! Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to 
Vault 111 immediately. need to get in. We're on the list. Infant. Adult male. Adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, ma'am. And God help us all. You two, follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? doing everything we can. Now keep moving. This way. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Hold on! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... No, we no. Don't, be. don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. Just this way, please. Mail. This way. Vault Tech is here for you. All this way. news this is good. Please Step proceed the table. in an orderly fashion. Just this way. Mail. No, no, female. Oh, welcome. Pick up a suit right over there. Here you Just are. Just step over Head down the hall there. Right over there. Yeah, this looks fine. You'll need your suits before we can take you further. Welcome to Vault 111. I'm sure you'll feel right hey, at home in no that elevator. So slow. Take your suit. You'll need it. Uh, thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything Sir? we had. My mother and father down in D.C. How long do you think we'll be down here? I know. Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical Good items we have to get checking through. Everyone off the list is designed to be fashionable in. as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. <laughs> Shh. Can you come here?
contaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four. Has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh God! Biogenic array. Residents must vacate. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. What the hell? Must vacate. 
Where is everyone? Is this all that's left? Terminal's gotta be somewhere.
because I live and breathe. Oh, it's, it's really you. Codsworth. What happened to the world? The world, sir? Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Beck. Where is your better half, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Or oh, perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you...? A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give and take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. What? No. I, I, I need help, Codsworth, not food. Sir, I have been thinking, if something is amiss, your loved ones may simply be hiding from the Red Menace. Codsworth, buddy, I don't think the Reds are going to be a problem anymore. I have an idea. Let's search the neighborhood together. After all, the Mrs. and young Sean, they're, they're my family too. I don't know, Codsworth, I... Follow me! What's all this, then? Not this time! in another house. Follow me! Hey, Codsworth. Sir, the Mrs. and young Sean, they aren't here. 
Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. What about Concord, sir? Plenty of people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge, out of the neighborhood, and past the Red Rocket Station? I shall remain here and secure the home front. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You lose your owner, buddy. Okay, then. Let's stick together.